back to another part of Ace Attorney. So now we're gonna watch a, a, a questionable video. Let's let's just hope nothing's wrong with the video. How's it questionable? Already questionable. How is it questionable? Is it because of the blue badger? Something falls out of the locker. And there's beacons. There's Mike Meekins. <laughs> oh crap. And apparently there was the fight. Oh. And then there's beacons on the ground. Pretty decisive evidence of it. Well, I believe we're all thinking the same thing. How can we deal with these unsettling feelings stirred within us? What the hell was that railing piece of plywood? Sir, that, that is the pride and joy of the entire criminal affairs department, sir. It's Blue Badger, sir. Why am I not surprised this isn't going smoothly? Yeah, well, anyway. This tape seems to prove that the witness did indeed encounter uh, someone. In the evidence room and some sort of activity did take place, Your Honor. Instead of relying on clearly incomplete footage, the witness testimony will suffice. It is all right with you, Officer Meekins. Yes, yes, as you wish, sir. Mystery man. Oh yeah. Space can't be clearly seen in the video. There's no question that the other person was doing good with the sir. We, we, op we opened the locker, which the car detected good things for you to do. The locker you opened is a question of the detector good things locker, sir. What's this about a fingerprint? Each detective has been given the locker equipped with a fingerprint activated lock. These locks ensure that each lock can only be opened by the detective it belongs to. Intriguing. That would mean the victim on the crime scene would have had to be Detective Goodman. Very well. The defense may begin its cross examination. I don't know where this cross examination will lead, but everything begins with contradictions. That's where I have to start. Sir, 
up here on the defense. Point out something to this alleged contradiction in the video. the video. Great. Just take a good look and be sure to point out the right thing. Please don't pay too many times. I can't stand watching the video. How did this guy ever become a police officer? Now that Mr. Wright, please enlighten us. There is a contradiction that indicates that the man may not be the good man. That's strange about the video has got to be this. Officer Meekins. Sir, do you mean me, sir? Well, who else? As I understand it, the locker apparatus works like this. When you grab the handle while sensor reaches for your grip, the grip matches. The register data, the lights are on the locker is released. According to my very limited experience, that's the way I understand it, sir. If so, then something is seriously wrong with this picture.
Please watch closely. This is the continuation of part one I showed you earlier. What's this? Something white right fell out of the locker. But sir, it's been my experience that things fall out when doors are opened. I often fall out and roll great distances when I open my car. We can't be sure that the item in the locker what well, that item was in the locker to begin with. What do you mean? The sensor triggers the lock when the door is shut. What if something was inserted, say, between the sensor and the door? Inserted? Yes, inserted. This white thing was inside the locker. It was stuck between the door and the sensor. I understand now. It's just like my tie. Two out of three times I get stuck in the door when I get behind my patrol vehicle, sir. Instead of the door. Wait, how does your tie put the object? have to be extremely thin fit in the door. Not only that, you can also have to block the door. Oh, curtains. You need to be an instant. Yes, an instant. But I'm perhaps you know, it just might be something that fits in the description. But sir, but if by instant, you don't mean... I think I've finally got this figured out. Very well. The defense prep can present that relevant evidence. What was What was this inside here that was stuck in the door? Um... this near the locker, a thin rubber glove. But we can't be sure that was in the victim's locker. Here's the tag on it that says SL9 incident. The video seems to depict the victim opening the locker. But that isn't the case. The, la the lit lamp attests to this. On the day of the crime, even I could have opened that locker. Is that not so, Officer Meekins? Would appear so, sir? Order! 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 So, I was really that the was stabbed by the evidence What do you mean, Mr. Earth? The defense has really demonstrated the possibility that nothing more. The victim in the video was a deep bruise good. testify about this? Sir? Me, sir? No, no, no. I'm not sure what you're referring to, sir. Oh, you mean that, sir? Of course, sir. Is this a joke? Very well, begin your testimony.
chokes. Maybe I should fix At any rate, he's released the box from the end. One ID bar. Both of these are running at once. Right 
right into the prosecution's trap. What are you talking about? Cross-examination has proven one thing and one thing only. The security video did not show the actual murder. Subpoenade? What kind of name word is? What kind of word is this? <sighs> Whatever. Whatever. Will the prosecution please prepare the witness during this time? We will, Your Honor. A court in recess. Interrupting anything, pals. Thanks, Gumshoe. Oh, guess I am. I'll, I'll come back later. Oh, just heard Gumshoe. What is it? You got a lot more if I'm making a detective run all around while on duty. I've seen happier people at funerals. You better be a pal. Hey. 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 Hey! Hey! I didn't see you there, Miss Sky! That's okay. So, what do you remember what I asked? Oh. Oh ho! Oh ho ho! Oh ho ho ho! Oh ho ho ho! You mean this, right? My apologies, since I've been my present circumstances. I was supposed to use Mr. Wright's name when making my request. My name?
Now I brought you your stuff. You're just gonna ignore me, Emma? But why? Why is your name in here? Uh oh. Something bad. My name's in there. I don't know, unless. No, it couldn't be. Lana? Is that something I need to. Is that. That's the classification number. The police followed it under. Two years ago, the rest of the world knew it as. Joe Dark Killer. So dark. No, no, Lana. That's over with. No. Come on, wait. You ran away. You know what? I, just, I gotta be somewhere. I gotta, sorry, I gotta, gotta get out. See you guys in the next part so when we continue the rest of today's this day's trial. So yeah, yeah, yeah.